What are the five steps of protein synthesis? The five steps of protein synthesis are Transcription Translation Folding Modifications Secretion 1. Transcription is the first step of gene expression, in which a particular segment of DNA is copied into RNA by the enzyme RNA polymerase. RNA polymerase reads the template strand of DNA in the 3 to 5 direction and creates a complementary RNA strand in the 5 to 3 direction. Transcription occurs in the nucleus, where the DNA is stored. Protein synthesis is the second step of gene expression, in which the RNA molecule produced in transcription is used to produce a protein. The RNA molecule is first read by a ribosome, which assembles amino acids in the correct order according to the sequence of nucleotides in the RNA molecule. The amino acids then form a protein, which may be a structural protein or an enzyme. 2. Translation is the process of converting the sequence of a gene into a protein. It begins with the binding of a ribosome to an mRNA molecule. The ribosome then moves along the mRNA, translating it into a protein. Protein synthesis is the process by which proteins are made. It begins with the DNA of a gene being transcribed into RNA. The RNA is then translated into a protein. 3. Folding is the third step and it is essential for protein function. Proteins are composed of amino acids that are arranged in a specific sequence. This sequence is determined by the gene that encodes the protein. Once a protein is synthesized, it must fold into a specific three-dimensional structure in order to function properly. This process is called protein folding. Protein folding is a complex process that is not completely understood. It is thought to be mediated by a number of different factors, including the protein's primary structure, the surrounding medium, and the protein's environment within the cell. Once a protein is synthesized, it is typically unfolded and must fold into its proper three-dimensional structure in order to function. This process is called protein folding. 4. Modifications is the fourth step, during which the protein is modified by the addition of small molecules, such as lipids or carbohydrates. Enzymes add or remove functional groups from the amino acids that make up proteins. This modification is essential for the proper function of many proteins. Protein modification can occur during or after protein synthesis. Modifications that occur during protein synthesis are typically done by enzymes that are attached to the ribosome, the cell's protein synthesis machinery. These enzymes can add or remove functional groups from the amino acids as they are being assembled into proteins. After protein synthesis, proteins can be further modified by other enzymes. These enzymes can add or remove functional groups, or they can change the structure of the protein by breaking and forming new bonds. Protein modification is important for many reasons. It can be used to regulate the activity of proteins, or to change their function. Protein modification can also be used to target proteins to specific locations in the cell, or to help them interact with other proteins. 5. Secretion is the fifth and final step and the liver plays a major role in this process. The liver is the largest gland in the human body and is responsible for a variety of important functions, including secretion and protein synthesis. The liver produces a number of different proteins, including enzymes, hormones, and clotting factors. It also produces bile, a substance that helps to break down fats in the digestive process. The liver is constantly working to produce the proteins that the body needs in order to function properly. This process is known as protein synthesis. The liver uses a variety of amino acids to create proteins. Amino acids are the building blocks of proteins. The liver synthesizes proteins by combining amino acids in a specific order. The liver is able to synthesize a wide variety of proteins because it has a large number of different enzymes. Enzymes are proteins that catalyze chemical reactions in the body. The liver has enzymes that catalyze the synthesis of proteins, as well as enzymes that catalyze the breakdown of proteins. If you feel your body needs some assistance with protein synthesis you may consider using HMB supplements which have proven to be very effective. 
To learn more about HMB supplements, please follow the link below.